And we are back now with a woman who turned her dream not into reality, but into fiction. Stephanie Meyer, she's an Arizona mother of three, wrote down a story idea that came to her in her sleep. Now hundreds of fans line up for her autograph. Her first two novels each spent more than 50 weeks on the bestseller list, and her latest book, Eclipse, hits stores today, and she joins us live right now. Good morning. Good morning. Now, this story seems too good to be true. It's more of a fairy tale <laughs> than a story. It really came to you in a dream? It did. It sounds a little cheesy, but I had this really fantastic dream. I didn't think, I'm going to write this into a great novel. I thought, I better write this down or I'm going to forget it. So what was the nugget? The nugget was a boy and a girl in a meadow having this conversation about how they were in love and the difficulties in that because he wanted to kill her. He was a vampire. That, that is a problem. <laughs> yes, you're right. <laughs> but the other problem you had is I have no idea how you did this. When this dream came to you, you had three little boys. They're 10, 7, and 5 now, but they were toddlers then. How did you write this book? A lot of sleep was lost to the cause. Um, I became very nocturnal while I was doing it. Well, it was, that's appropriate. It was. <laughs> it was. Uh, I was really obsessive about it. I was enjoying myself so much. And everybody here is enjoying themselves this morning. You girls came from everywhere. Texas? <laughs> There's Texas, Canada. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> and, and I guess I have to ask you this question. I want a brave volunteer right now. What is it about Bella, the main character, that, that, that grabs you? Go ahead, what is it? She's so ordinary, like, she's clumsy and stuff, and she gets, you know, get the great guy in the book. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty good outcome, right? And, and, and is, that, is, that, is that what came to you? You really just wanted to make her every girl? I did. I, there's so many heroes out there who have super magical powers and they can do these great things. I identify more easily with someone who's just human. And I think that's a lot of her appeal, is all of us can understand being just human. But not every girl gets a vampire. That's true. That was a nice perk. <laughs> <laughs> and, and if I understand it correctly, the, the vampire is pursuing Bella. Oh, no, no. The va Bella likes the vampire, but the werewolf is pursuing Bella. In That's a really part. complicated triangle. It is. <laughs> you know, you have your, when your best friend's a werewolf you girls are your the boyfriend. best audience I've ever had. Thank <laughs> you for coming here this morning. Uh, and and what, what, what do you hope happens to Bella next? Have you thought Oh, ahead? I know what happens next. You know I mean, what happens? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know everything that happens. So it's, uh, I'm working on book four right now, so I'm well ahead in the story. Already well ahead. Yes. You must hate all these comparisons to Harry Potter. You know, it's a really, really flattering thing. I just don't think there's ever going to be another Harry Potter phenomenon. It's not going to happen. Um, I'm just really excited I get to be Stephanie Meyer. This is, that's way more than I ever asked for. It's well, it is a, a real phenomenon here right now. That you're basically heading towards your, th your third bestseller in a row. Eclipse is already sent. We had to limit the number of people that could come <laughs> to the audience today. Did you ever imagine no. it would be like this? No, and it's still so overwhelming just to have all these people so excited to see me. You know, it shocks me. What do your boys think of it? Oh, you know, moms are the epitome of normal, so they think that everyone's mom does this. Everyone's mom does this? <laughs> yeah, this is just do, they take, do. do they identify more with the vampire or the werewolf? Oh, they're divided. My oldest really likes the werewolf, but my second one is the vampire. The second one is the vampire? Yeah, he likes the vampires better. Is he a, is he a tough kid? He is, actually. <laughs> He's very tough. Okay, well, Stephanie Meyer, thank you very much. This is also going to be a movie. Yes, well, hopefully. It's optioned right now. It's We're optioned hoping. right now. Terrific. Stephanie Meyer, thank you very much for being thank here you so much. today. A clip goes on sale today. You can read an extra from your ABC News And next, their music has been called Soulful, Electrifying, Heart Pumping. Our GMA breakout artist, Grace Potter, and the 